Oh my goodness, here it is. The Fanquisher pickaxe. That looks so sick. And uh, yeah, that is actually a bonus out challenge. <laughs> guys welcome back to another video and today i'll be telling you guys how you can complete the brand new bullseye challenges as well as get the brand new vanquisher pickaxe so guys before we do get into this video make sure guys do smash the like and subscribe if you are new and guys make sure you support the creator code fluxy in your fortnite item shop it does really help me out so let's just jump right in the video hope you all do enjoy Alrighty, guys so as you can see we are in the fortnite lobby right now and if we head away over to the challenges you'll be able to see the brand new bullseye challenges are here so as you can see boom there we go there they are and there's so many of them which look super good and yeah just look at them guys so basically the first one is land the different bullseyes that would be pretty easy then we got hit weak points while harvesting then get an elimination with a sniper rifle so yeah those challenges seem really easy and yeah we end up getting this awesome pickaxe which looks super cool and yeah if we go to prestige we end up getting the silver version of like the knight person so this is going to be a good challenge so yeah if we make our way over to the item shop you'll be able to see the brand new zone wars challenge bundle that looks so sick and it also comes with the different selectable styles so i think i'm gonna have to get this after this video but yeah those are insane so guys if you are going to get this place use code flux in your item shop just like that and honestly it does really help me out so yeah, let's just jump into some games here. So guys, the most advice that I give you is actually go into play into some Team Rumble because that means you'll be able to get multiple challenges done in one game. So the first challenge is actually just to land on top of a bullseye. Land on three different bullseyes as well as make points and get a sniper rifle. So I could probably get all three of them done in one game. So yeah, let's just jump right into this Team Rumble game. Alrighty guys, so we can even do this challenge actually out in the lobby. So basically, if you're just sitting out here, you gotta hit the little red dots. Well, not the red dots, like the blue dots. So just do that in the lobby as well if you wanna get any more of these challenges done. So as you can see, you only need to hit those little blue things. And at the left hand side of the screen, you'll be able to see all of the little challenges popping up whenever I hit this. So as you can see there, they all do hit it. So now all we gotta do is land in different bullseyes. So as you can see, there's one literally right below me right here. So I'm just gonna jump out and land on top of it now. And there's also one over there at Paradise as well as probably at that side. But yeah, I'm just gonna land over here. Okay, so I'm about to land on it in three, two, one, and boom there we go we landed on that so all we need to do now is land on two more of them and that is the challenge done Alrighty, guys so we just got a sniper and we are also approaching this next bullseye so basically if you have a grappler or a glider redeploy or anything just build up beside it and therefore just glide on top of it so as you can see once you get up here i'm just going to get up a little bit higher and yeah just glide over like this so as you can see it is right here and boom there we go we should have it and yes that does actually count so you can do these in multiple games so all we gotta do now is find the other one and i will see you guys over at that Alrighty, guys so as you can see we are approaching the next bullseye over here and we've did these all in one game so it's just gonna be outside of zone but it's okay because we can still land on it so basically i did all of these in one game so i just basically went in the team rumble game uh got the guns and yeah just glided over to these places so that's how you do them super fast and let's see if we are about to get, get this challenge done and there we go that is all three bullseyes done in one game so you guys can do that super fast as well so that's one of the challenges done so all we gotta do now is get a uh, sniper rifle eliminations and that's it Alrighty, so while i'm in the storm i'm just gonna keep on harvesting and get all these little uh, weak points of the tree but yeah all we gotta do now is get around 25 more of these and that will be this challenge done so i will see you guys just after we complete this challenge <laughs> Alrighty, so we just got that challenge done, which was super easy, and yes, we died. So, so guys, we just completed all those challenges, so all we gotta do now is get a sniper rifle elimination, so I'm gonna try to get this guy here, if I can. Yes, we just got that, and as you saw at the left there, we actually did complete that. So that is all the first three challenges done in one game, and since we got that done in the Team Mumble game, we can back out now and just move on to the next challenge. So I'm gonna back out now and complete these next challenges. Okay, so we just backed out, and as you can see, we actually reached tier 100 that game, so... I finally made it to tier 100. Let's go. But anyway, we should have those challenges complete. So that's one challenge of the bullseye. Then we got another one. And there should be a third one with the loading screen. Actually, no, it was just three battle stars. But anyway, let's go over to the challenges. And this should be just here. So 42% complete already. All we got to do now is complete three more or four more. And that is us got this pickaxe. So all we got to do now is hit 10 headshots. And then complete the skydiving course over at Fatal Fields. And then hit easy fire and range target. Wherever that is. But yet, yeah, then we got one more after that. So I'm going to show you guys 
realize where all these different locations are and uh, yeah these challenges are super easy so let's hop into another team rumble game okay so as you can see the little skydiving course is right here so all we got to do now is jump out of the battle bus as soon as we're about to hit this and go through there but the good thing about this location is that one of the easy uh, target thing is right beside it so i'm just gonna glide through here and i'll show you guys where the little uh, target shooter is so let's do this so go through all these different rings hopefully i make it over here yes this is actually super easy to do and you can do them all in super fast in one game so that is it done so all we got to do now is make our way over here to lucky landing and there is actually an easy target thing literally right beside it right here so as you can see just here on the map right beside lucky landing as well as beside the big field of fields so all you got to do now is just make your way over here get a gun at least and yeah here is the location right here on this little hill just in front of lucky landing Alrighty, so I'm gonna go grab a gun and hopefully I do end up getting that challenge done in this game as well. Guys, so if you wanna start this challenge, as you can see, I've got a few guns here. So if you just wanna make a way over, you stand here and then you gotta shoot these little targets. Hopefully I do actually get it. And yeah, that's really it. So you gotta hit one target and that is that challenge done. Okay, so the second last challenge we've gotta do now is actually hit headshots, which is super easy. So all we gotta do now is find somebody and lose them with this SMG. Alrighty, so the best advice that I give you all to get the headshot challenge done fast is grab an SMG AR or any fast brain gun because you don't really want to do it with the shotgun because you don't really hit headshots with them as much because you only hit one headshot and that is in dead. So you want to get an SMG so you can easily get the challenge done. And I see people over here at the supply drop, so I'm going to go over here quickly and use my SMG. Okay, so there's people here, so I'm just going to go headshot and I missed every head. So let's try to get him. Okay, so I got one headshot there, but I need more than one. Oh, we got one more headshot there. Oh my goodness, we got so many headshots. Oh, and unfortunately, we died, but we got six headshots there. So all we need now is four more headshots on any player. So let's get this challenge over and done with. Okay, right, this, this player. Yes! Oh my goodness, he was literally a one tap. Guys, we need one more headshot. Yes, we just did it, guys. That is all the challenges done for this game. So I'm just going to kill this guy here. And then we'll be able to back out of the game. Alrighty, guys. So we just completed those challenges. So all you got to do now is complete one more. So as you see, we are back and out with this loading screen. So hopefully it does say we've completed these. So as you can see there, Bullseye Challenge complete with a 5k XP. Then we got 10k Battle Stars as well as another 10 Battle Stars. So if we go over the challenges now, you will be able to see that we only need to do one more. And it is only destroy loot carriers from 15 meters away. So so we only need to do two of them okay so basically to do this challenge we gotta land at the hot drops and yeah this is gonna be super easy so we need to do two of them so let's just jump right into another team rumble game okay, so we are in the next game and pressure plant is the next hot drop so all we gotta do is land here destroy loot carriers from 50 meters away and a pressure plant that'll be super easy because usually they fly off the side and yeah let's get this challenge over and done with okay so first of all i need to grab a gun so hopefully there is a ar or something right here uh, boom, there actually is an AR right on the little bit where I can shoot them from. So let's see how far we need to destroy it. So maybe this one. Yep, that's one straight away. And then there is one more down here, it looks like. So let's get this one. Uh, boom, that is all the challenges done, guys. So all we got to do now is literally just back out of the game. And that should be all these challenges done. So everybody, just back out once you've got your challenges done. And I can't wait to get this brand new pickaxe because it looks so awesome. So, guys, we're going to do a sign test of it as well. So definitely stay tuned for that. So, yeah, let's get into this. And hopefully we do actually have the challenge done. As, yeah, we just backed out instantly. Oh, my goodness. Here it is, the Fanquisher pickaxe. That looks so sick sick and yeah that is actually the bullseye challenges okay so this pickaxe looks super awesome and it looks really big as well so we gotta equip that as we are using the black knight and wherever it is oh my goodness so yeah let's get a sound test right in the lobby because we might as well all right so let's move on to the sound test in three two one and Okay, that literally sounds so awesome. Alrighty, so since we have that equipped, I'm actually going to equip the new tier 100 skin just right here. As well as put it on its back wing because you gotta know this is the tier 100 pickaxe. So yeah, let's go into uh, creative game and let's move on to sound tests. Oh my goodness, we've made it into this game. And look at the size of this pickaxe. It is massive. What do you mean? Oh my goodness. So let's move on to sound test, guys. This is going to be crazy. Okay, so let's move the sound test. This pickaxe is actually the biggest thing in the game. So let's do this right now. It looks so cool so okay so the sound of this pickaxe it, it just sounds big if you know what i mean like you don't hear a pickaxe that sounds like this ever really so yeah i'm gonna hit it off the ground and just spam it here so 
So yeah, it's just basically a big metal block where you smack things with, which is probably going to do a lot of damage. Well, not really, but yeah, it does 20 damage to players, and of course, it just looks awesome, and it looks pretty scary if a player runs with you at this. So guys, that is actually the sound test of this pickaxe, so let's back out to the lobby. Alrighty guys, so that is the sound test of this Vanquisher pickaxe. It is awesome, but it's a little bit too big for a pickaxe, if you know what I mean. But yeah, I don't think I will be using this pickaxe anytime soon, because it's just too big, and I like smaller pickaxes. Guys, if this video did help you out completing all those challenges and unlocking the Vanquisher pickaxe, make sure you guys do smash like and subscribe if you haven't already. And guys, make sure you support the credit code Fluxy in your Fortnite item shop, just like that. It honestly does really help me out. So yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this video, and um, peace. Oh, yeah.